Hello and welcome to this beginner's guide to vehicle cyber security. In this video we will delve into ISO 21434, a comprehensive standard for managing cyber security risks in the automotive industry. Whether you're an enthusiast or a professional stepping into the world of automotive cyber security, this video will provide you with a detailed understanding of ISO 21434, including its scope, key concepts, processes, benefits and practical implementation tips. To start with, let's introduce ISO SEA 21434. ISO SE8 21434 is a comprehensive international standard developed to address cybersecurity within the automotive industry. It provides a framework for managing cybersecurity risks throughout the entire life cycle of a vehicle, from the initial concept to decommissioning. By following this standard, organizations can ensure that cybersecurity is integrated into every phase of a vehicle's life cycle, helping to protect against potential threats and vulnerabilities. ISO 21434 applies to all entities involved in the development and production of automotive systems, including vehicle manufacturers, suppliers and service providers. It covers electrical and electronic systems, software and their interactions. Essentially, if you're working on any component of a vehicle that involves electronics or software, ISO 21434 is relevant to you. ISO 21434 is divided into several clauses, each addressing different aspects of cybersecurity management. Let's break down the key clauses. Introduction scope and normative references. These sections provide an overview of the standard, its applicability and references to other related standards. Terms and definitions. This section defines the key terms used throughout the standard to ensure a common understanding. General requirement establishes general principles for cybersecurity, including the need for cybersecurity policy, organization, and culture within the company. Cybersecurity management focuses on establishing a cybersecurity management system that includes roles and responsibilities, competencies, awareness, communication, and continuous improvement. Project dependent cybersecurity management addresses project specific activities including project initiation, planning, monitoring and assessment. Continuous cybersecurity activities cover an ongoing activities such as vulnerability monitoring, incident response and cybersecurity updates. Concept phase emphasizes the importance of considering cybersecurity during the initial concept phase of a vehicle. This includes threat analysis and risk assessment or TARA for short, and defining cybersecurity goals. Product development, detailed cybersecurity activities during the product development phase, including requirements, design, implementation, verification, and validation. Post development focuses on activities after development, such as production, operation, maintenance, and decommissioning. It includes monitoring, incident response, and update management. Threat Analysis Risk Assessment, or TARA, provides guidance on conducting TARA, identifying potential threats, assessing risks, and defining appropriate mitigation measures. Lastly, Cybersecurity Assurance Level, or CAL, introduces the concept of CAL, which categorizes the level of cybersecurity assurance required based on the risk assessment. Now let's look closely into the key processes within ISO 21434. Cybersecurity Governance This involves establishing a cybersecurity policy and governance structure within the organisation. It ensures that there are clear roles and responsibilities and that everyone understands their part in maintaining cybersecurity. Risk Management Conducting TARA is a critical part of this process. It involves identifying potential threats, assessing the risks associated with these threats and implementing strategies to mitigate those risks. Cybersecurity by design. This means integrating cybersecurity considerations into the design and development phases of the automotive systems right from the start. It's about building security into the product rather than adding it on later. Verification and validation. This involves performing cybersecurity testing and validation to ensure that the implemented measures are effective. 
Techniques such as penetration testing, vulnerability scanning, and static code analysis are used. Incident response and monitoring. Establishing processes for monitoring, detecting, and responding to cybersecurity incidents is critical. This ensures that all threats are quickly identified and dealt with. And lastly, supply chain management. Managing cybersecurity risks within the supply chain by defining requirements for suppliers and ensure they are compliant. This includes conducting supplier assessments and audits before using them. Implementing ISO 21434 offers several benefits. Firstly, it enhances security. By following the standard, organizations can significantly improve the cybersecurity posture of their vehicles, protecting against potential threats and vulnerabilities. Regulatory compliance. ISO 21434 helps organizations comply with regulatory requirements and industry standards such as UNEC Regulation 155. Risk reduction. Conducting TARA and implementing mitigation measures reduces the likelihood and impact of cybersecurity incidents. And lastly, consumer trust. Demonstrating a commitment to cybersecurity can enhance consumer trust and embrace confidence in the brand. Here are some practical implementation tips for ISO 21434. Develop a cybersecurity culture. Promote a culture of cybersecurity awareness within the organization through training and communication. Make sure everyone understands the importance of cybersecurity and their role in maintaining it. Engage stakeholders early. Involve all relevant stakeholders, including engineers, designers, and suppliers early in the development process to ensure cybersecurity is considered at every stage. Leverage existing standards and frameworks. Use existing cybersecurity standards and frameworks to complement the requirement of ISO 21434. Conduct regular audits and assessments. Perform regular audits and assessments to ensure ongoing compliance with ISO 21434 and identify areas for improvement. Stay informed of emerging threats. Continuously monitor the cybersecurity landscape to stay informed about emerging threats and vulnerabilities and update your cybersecurity measures accordingly. In conclusion, understanding ISO 21434 is essential for anyone involved in the automotive industry. This standard helps ensure that vehicles are designed with cybersecurity in mind, protecting users from potential threats. By following ISO 21434, organizations can improve their security posture, comply with regulatory requirements, and gain consumer trust. Thank you for watching.